an initial bond with her when I first met her. And it wasn't apparent to me. I kind of felt it back then, but I didn't really know what that was, or I didn't know how to articulate that, that I felt like I knew her. Um, and then over the years, I've, you know, she's, her family has become my family, my family have become her family because I've understood who she is and I've watched her in lots of different reincarnations. And she will tell you herself, um, mind you, you do like a label, I can see that by those Versace glasses, but she doesn't like a label as like she is uh, a model or an actor or a singer or whatever that is. She, uh, and and I, I respect that because you can be lots of things and you don't have to be, um, somebody doesn't have to be able to put you into a, into a certain box, like you are this, because we can be as many things as we want. Um, and, you know, over the past few years especially, like I've become far more in tune with that because of her, because she's helped me to articulate what those things are and to understand that, um, that it's not strange that you should feel those things and to actually allow yourself to be able to feel that. Um, and so it's... And I kind of think, we've spoken about this a lot, there are two sorts of people. There are people who will awaken and there are people who, you know, probably won't awaken. And that's okay because, you know, everybody in their own time. Um, but what is amazing about this book and the fact that, um, that she actually can write um, and something that is quite riveting, if, if you've woken up, you will get so much out of this. You will understand what, uh, what wavelength or what frequency Lenita vibrates at. I love that word, vibrate at. Um, it's very high frequency over here. Um, I was a fairly low frequency and have become uh, a mid to high frequency person. Um, and uh, if, you, if you've awoken, you'll get that. If you don't, at worst, if you are vibrating still at a low frequency, it's okay. It's not, you're not doomed. It still, you can change that. Um, but if you're vibrating at a low frequency, um, it's just a really great book and it's a really nice story about a fashion girl and you know and if that's what you get from it bless and that's great um but you too can be a high frequency vibrator um <laughs> but i do love that word i do love that word like myself um but i aspire to to vibrate the frequency um, of my friend who i love so much um and uh, I think before you even hear her, you need to give her a round of applause because um, she's inspirational to me. And I have to say, I love seeing women do incredible things. I've, I've sort of made my career, you know, based on making them look beautiful and feel great about themselves. But I, nothing gives me uh, more respect or uh, a greater feeling than when I see uh, incredible, strong beautiful, talented women doing things, um, and especially vibrating outside of the box. Um, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> my incredibly talented, very beautiful friend, Lenita.